Okay, so 12.59, alright, 12.59 on the uh, 15th of February, just after Valentine's Day. I'm here at Topic Square, got a little art exhibit ready for the uh, city when they come to take it. And that's actually them over there right now. I'm not sure if I can zoom this in properly. I think that's a digital zoom. Uh, I have I have more pictures of it. Uh, they're they're actually in formation. <laughs> they're in a vanguard formation, ready to move in on us. But uh, we've already gotten our essentials out of here. They're over at the art academy. Uh, that's documented. Everything that we leave here is for them. It's for the city. For the city to store and waste taxpayer money on storage space. And police tape too, evidently, because uh, yeah, they came by and just went ahead and put police tape on this, on these benches. I mean, they're broken anyways, but you know, they they, they never put any kind of uh, warning there before. There's, there's no reason. They they just thought, hey, we have police tape. Let's go tape shit. So yeah. Uh, I'm currently up from Mako's a little bit. Not sure what building is here, but apparently we lost our privileges to stay at the Honolulu uh, Academy of Arts. That sucks. So we went ahead and uh, moved it down the street a little bit. Here's the rest of our stuff. But yeah, that sucks. More of the city is working against us. Alright, uh, walking down Ward right now, going back to camp. Cab driver came by and was saying like, "Oh, you guys are supposed to be on public property," and our stuff is moved, of course, because the city's here trying to uh, move us out. So we're temporarily moving, so we can move back. Basically, you know, the, 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 their their job is to come and clean up the park. So we're just gonna leave and then come back. You know, if their job is to clean up the park, we'll let them clean the park. You see what I'm saying? That that's what they say their job is. Of course, their job is to push around the homeless. Make sure that they're not hanging around the parks, not especially not in town, not anywhere near uh, Waikiki, not where you know, not where the trolley routes are, definitely. So that's camp right now across the street. Uh, bare bones. Most of that stuff is tagged. We're gonna let them take it. I'm just moving back in just to see that uh, if uh, they need any help moving anything else. Otherwise, we're good. Otherwise, we're solid, and the city won't be able to touch us. Ladies and gentlemen, the city. So we're recording them. Our stuff is safe. Police to keep the peace <clears throat> to keep the peace to <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. What is that? It's 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 almost like a smock. So you're saying that white chair that the backpack is on? Yeah, the white chair, the ashtray, that Back stuff wasn't even here. So you know what we do? We go get your jet there. That thing will move on there. Okay, that's okay. This is, this is how it is. Is this 342? Pardon me. Oh, no way. No way. That high. That guy has a great shirt. It says, sorry, mine closed until further notice. They have 
I got a picture. <laughs> so there's some books over there. Um, I guess I'll look. So one, two, three officers. That's a sergeant. And all these uh, city workers. This is um, this is what they do to the uh, homeless people here. I'm just I'm looking actually to see if um, any of these books we should hold on to. Um, I don't feel particularly like holding on to any of these books. Three Musketeers? I mean, if anyone else feels strongly for it to save them, then I guess we will. They're looking through a backpack right now. They're emptying the contents of it. The truck that they're uh, loading everything into the back then. their photos and they said that it was. Well, they also said that about the white chair. Yeah, well, that sucks. I... My phone is dead. I don't know. I mean, they're looking through his stuff already. He wasn't until later, yeah. Yeah, so it looks like they're, tag they're taking stuff that hasn't been tagged, which uh, goes against uh, Ordinance 1129. Yeah, it is. Even according to classic book, I want to punch your face by the pinky show. We'll make sure they film how the back off they're not offering it to anyone. I already recorded that. Yeah. They, they in no way are here to help the public. bag that he just took. Yeah. I thought that was D'Angelo's. D'Angelo's stuff was in Yeah. Well, I can't contact Sam right now. 
There's no, that's a storage bin, huh? That's not a trash bin, huh? Right. To let you know, it's not a trash bin. Police are telling us we got to stand five feet back from our own stuff. you up real quick. So, 15th of uh, February, 2012, uh, another eviction taking place. The city is here. Um, that's um, Parks and Recreation that uh, you see in the uh, brightly colored jackets. That right there in the Aloha shirt is uh, a sergeant of HPD and he's got two other officers here with him, you know, to help facilitate uh, cleaning up the park. So this is what happened. <clears throat> this is what happens with the uh, homeless here. Oh, excuse me. Taking apart our things, putting it into bins, loading it up in those trucks. They already went through uh, someone's backpack. Uh, they went through someone's backpack. They dumped the contents out. Uh, they looked at it all. They took anything that was liquid, um, then put it all back in there. And I think they just took his bag. So that sucks. I'm not sure how I'm going to tell them that. I mean, they, yeah. <laughs> so that's what's going on right now. We got this for them, though. They're going to deal with that last, of course. Excuse me. So yeah, violated Fourth Amendment rights already. Yeah, well, multiple when times. When they're done. When they're done. So ho hopefully when they're done they don't just book it, right? <laughs> so they don't have to actually answer legitimate questions about rifling through Rights and law and stuff that yeah. they don't know anything about in the first place, right? So now they're eyeing out the second part of this. The uh, Valentine's gift <laughs> that a few people made. <laughs> There's Trish right now. She's smiling about it. <laughs> 
<laughs> They're all gathered around and waiting. Okay. All right. I'll see you. They're just waiting. They haven't even touched it yet. Have a picture of this ottoman. City come and they take uh, our stuff. <laughs> Excuse oh, me. sorry about that. Excuse me. Come on, partner. Okay, I can have to move. You can move back, please. Thank you. So they're telling me get back five feet. Tried standing five feet. Just told me to move. Got pushed out of the way a little bit early by a city worker. So whatever. It's just a job to them. That definitely wasn't here yesterday. No pictures of that. They just threw it. They tore the sign. Wait a minute, store it, don't throw it away? That means they throw stuff away. Right. Okay, so she's finding out where it is. It was noticed yesterday. It was noticed yesterday. Okay. And we do every time we come back for the storage of the uh, you know, you kind of have to the inventory. Yeah, no, totally. So I just wanted to make sure that it was actually tagged. And then my question, my second question is why it was gone. Uh, because, I mean, I've seen no, other, have to, because other things. Have to. If it's flammable or anything wet, we have to go it. Yeah. The storage and disposal notice is on that pole. Okay. So you have 30 days. 
okay? It'll be stored for 30 days, free of charge. You can pick it up whenever you want to call that. Okay, but whoever it belongs to, you know who it belongs to, tell that individual, please, that they have 30 days. Okay. Okay, so uh, they, they just cleaned out this park. People need to, people need to stay here. Um, hey, they might be going up. Like everybody else, you obeyed a traffic law. Look at that, it says don't walk. Come on. Not walking. I think they're going up to... Uh, So they're moving right now. They have left the park. The park officials have left the park. That's the park. This isn't the park. They're moving up to where we had our stuff. What the fuck? Private property. They've, they've left the park. You guys left the park. What are you doing? We have documentation that it was done private. So why is the Parks and Recreation over here off oh, of the hi, park? Oh, hi, 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 hi. Hi. Can you cut me a check for not oh, doing yeah. nothing? Okay, so... Um, so How long have you been uh, Trish, 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 there? Trish, Trish, Trish. Okay. So, uh, that yeah. issue is documented. Yeah. 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 So, so you own this property for all of this stuff. I don't want to do it. Would you like us to remove that property? Good. That'll that'll do. As long as everyone's gone by closing time. Hmm. as long as everyone is gone by closing time. Free speech. If you're interfering with my right, Sergeant Sando, to try to shush me. Stop me. Oh, it is not private property. There's no free speech on private property. Now I'm on the sidewalk. Do I have the sidewalk? Okay. Sidewalk? Okay, now do I have the right to free speech? Sergeant Thompson, do you understand this is not personal? This is political. So please don't be angry. So, uh... 
I tried to go inside to talk to the uh, woman who owns this place. Um, I just, I honestly just wanted to say like, hey, sorry about all this. We're not trying to mob you. We're not trying to cause a situation. All we wanted to do was move our stuff off the park somewhere else. Let the city do what they want to do. Let them clean the park, whatever, and then move back. That's it. Instead, they came all the way down to where we were, where we were, and now all this is happening. So, I mean, I went inside, Sergeant Santos uh, came out, asked me to step outside. He said, uh, are you allowed on the private property? I said, uh, yeah, no, this is clearly said no, or, well, I didn't say no. Clearly yeah, it's just harassment. It, it's he was trying to see if I was allowed to be on the property. I mean, it's an orthodontist. It's a place of business. Am I supposed to call ahead of time just to ask if I can step in their office? No, they have an office on ground floor, in front of a bus stop, for a reason. So I'm not even allowed to uh, go inside and try to talk to that woman, which is unfortunate. You're assuming they're not a value. So you just heard that. We're going to throw those away. That's the third time I have heard that. They're supposed to store everything. They're supposed to. But they don't. We know they don't. They keep trying to correct us and say they do, but they don't. They throw away most of the stuff. They throw away bikes. They throw away paint. They throw stuff away. Different ordinance. So what is it now? Man, what do you think? Should we get a truck out here and block off this lane? And they just load up everything. You know what? Take a picture of it here and then let's roll it back over there. Take a picture of it and then let's roll it back because this is too dangerous okay. to go right here with All the traffic. Right. So just roll that. We'll roll this one. Okay, this is HPD courtesy store. So according to the HPD courtesy store, it's a different ordinance from ours because a private property owner wants the property off. That's why we do the HPD courtesy store. And according to the ordinance, you only have to store the valuable items. Okay. And it's and it's as a courtesy to HPD. Our room is coming up. Our bed's coming up. And they'll be sure you know, we can just roll it down. Roll that down. So then, you know what? Let's just. So that that we've already determined to throw away. So this, let's go take this. Yeah, yeah, I guess so. They're not going to throw it away. They're not going to throw it away. You just they said it three times that they're throwing it away. You just said throw it away. Let's clarify it when we get back to the park. Just take their numbers and find out how you get it. This part is going to the HPD, yeah? And that one's going to be thrown away. You could follow that. Oh, oh, what is this? I'm so sorry that it's difficult to muscle your way in to that building and take their shit. Selective law enforcement. 
Greg's are not my daughter. Department of Parks and Recreations came off of the park, which is what their department is for, to go down the street to where we had our stuff. They went and got the owner of the building to come out and asked her if, if uh, they wanted us to move our stuff. She said it was fine until closing time. That's what she said. But now they have taken all of our stuff. They have our cart with our generator and all our tents and everything on it. They have um, our paint supplies that they have said three separate times that they're going to throw away. Throw away, not store. They're taking our chair. They're taking all of this. Three, throw away. What? They're throwing it away. They're throwing it away. They're throwing away um, the uh, API. They're throwing that away. Uh, they said throw away. Santos says, no, they're storing it. And I said, no, 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 no. Um, Whatever, Trish, whatever her name is, said three times that they're throwing it away. And uh, it's a courtesy to HPD. Alright, so, if whatever it is is not in the storage whatever place, there's another lawsuit because that's another violation of their own law. They, don't they have said it goes right under an ordinance. What ordinance? I don't fucking know. Yeah, see, they don't know either. <laughs> my, my general understanding of what I've gathered is that most of them don't know the law. Right. Thank you, guys. Hey, excuse me, Nathos. I was wondering, uh, so over there, it's under a different ordinance. Yeah, because it's, it's, it's not, it's private property. Yeah. That's not on the, doesn't belong to the property owner. It's property that doesn't belong to the property owner? Right. Would that belong oh, to the oh, property Oh, oh, I see, I see, okay. So it's different from the Bill 54. Right, so what ordinance is that? It's called found property. It's called found property. It's called found property. It's found property. Found property. Found property. Right. It's unattended items on private property. Okay. That, that we they'll store until someone can prove the ownership of it and then we release it. Alright. Thanks. But is that the stuff going in the truck? I don't know what's going in the truck. I'm not part. Alright, so apparently when we moved our shit, we went into another ordinance that deals with found wait, wait, wait. I gotta I gotta review the tape. <laughs>